hello everyone welcome to park mess and in this video i am going to solve this exponential problem that is 3 raised to power x minus 2 raised to power x is equal to 65 so to solve this math problem properly first of all we will write solution and we will rewrite this question in the solution again so the question is 3 raised to power x minus 2 raised to power x is equal to 65. In the next step, we can write this equation as implies 3 raised to power x whole power 2 by 2. We can divide and multiply a number in the power of any number minus same power this part of the equation 2 raised to power x whole raised to power 2 divided by 2 is equal to 65. In the next step, in the left side of this equation, we will use an exponential formula that is a raised to power m whole raised to power n can also be written as a raised to power m multiply n. So by using this formula in the left hand side of this equation, so it will become 3 raised to power x by 2 whole raised to power 2 minus 2 raised to power x by 2 whole raised to power 2 is equal to 65. This is because we can write 2 divided by 2 is 1 over 2 times 2. So we multiply this power inside the parenthesis with x. Next, let us suppose let 3s to power x by 2 is equal to m and 2s to power x by 2 is equal to n. So by substituting the value of 3 raised to power x by 2 and 2 raised to power x by 2 in this equation, so it will become implies m square minus n square is equal to 65. Again, my dears, here we will use an algebraic identity that is a square minus b square is equal to a plus b times a minus b. So by using this algebraic identity in this equation, it will become implies m plus n times m minus n is equal to 65. In the next step, we will factorize the right hand side. So we will write the left hand side as the same m minus n parenthesis closed and we can write 65 as 13 times 5. No. Let us suppose m plus n is equal to 13 and m minus n is equal to 5. Now, we will add these two equations to find the value of a variable m. So, let us add these two equations. This plus n and this minus n will be cancelled with each other. So, here only 2m will be left is equal to n13 plus 5 is 18. Now to find the value of m, we will divide both sides with 2. So it will become 2 will be cancelled with this 2 and here 2 times 1 is 2, 9 times 2 is 18. So the value of m is 9. Now to find the value of n, 
we will substitute this value of n in this equation so it will become implies m plus n so the value of m is 9 plus n is equal to 13 so it will become n is equal to 13 minus 9 so n is equal to 13 minus 9 is 4 so the value of m is 9 and the value of n is 4 now we need to find the value of x so we will substitute m and n back with their values since m is equal to 3 raised to power x by 2 and n is equal to 2 raised to power x by 2 so it will become we will substitute the value of m that was 3 raised to power x by 2 and here the value of m is 9 now let's simplify both sides implies 3 raised to power x by 2 is equal to we can write 9 as 3 raised to power 2 here on both sides the bases are same so we will compare the powers with each other so it will become implies x is equal to 2 is equal to 2 so it will become x is equal to 4 so one of the possible root of the above exponential equation is x is equal to 4 now we will substitute the value of n back that is n is equal to 2 raised to power x by 2 2 raised to power x by 2 is equal to the value of n here is 4 so we will write 4 here no next it will become implies 2 raised to power x by 2 we can write 4 as 2 raised to power 2 again on both sides the bases are same so we will compare the powers with each other so it will become implies x divided by 2 is equal to 2 again we will multiply both sides with 2 to get the value of x so it will become x is equal to 2 times 2 is 4 so again for the value of n we get the same value of x that is 4 as for both m and n the value of x is the same so it means that x is equal to 4 is the solution and the root of this exponential math problem now we will check that x is equal to 4 is the exact or correct root of this equation or not as the value of x satisfied this equation or not so we will check it here first we will write this exponential equation that is 3 raised to power x minus 2 raised to power x is equal to 65 now we will substitute x with 4 so it will become 3 raised to power 4 minus 2 raised to power 4 is equal to 65 so 3 raised to power 4 means multiply the number 3 4 times 3 times 3 is 9 9 times 3 is 27 and 27 times 3 is 81 minus 2 power 4 means multiply this base 4 times so multiplying 2 4 times we will get 16 is equal to 65 so here 11 minus 6 is 5 and here 7 will be left so 7 minus 1 is 6 and on the right hand side was the same number since both sides are equal so it means that x is equal to 4 is the exact and correct root of this exponential math problem